here we got, in my opinion, a very special tape. Back in the day, you know, getting into Dragon Ball Z was a phenomenal thing. And uh, this is uh, the Arrival VHS tape, which has the first, I think, three episodes of the beginning. This is like the very beginning of Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Z, the next generation has arrived. And this tape is like amazing. Like, look at the dragon in the background. Those eyes. This is just like an amazing way to present the beginning of the greatest uh, 2D animated show cartoon. And people always say, well, Dragon Ball Z is the, the greatest fighting anime. No, 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 no. Dragon Ball Z is the greatest anime, period. Not just the greatest fighting anime. Because it doesn't just have fighting in it. It has other stuff as well, like relationships and all that. Not that it does everything the best, but it really is the closest, I think, to being the best. I think it's the best. It's time for your lesson. Now pay attention. This felt like a movie because they combined it, all the episodes into one. They like edited all th the first three episodes into one feature. So it felt like a movie. And they presented it like a movie with this tape. Let's do this! This is going to be the fight of the century! We can conquer this beauty planet in our sleep. We'll see! On this planet we have something that we call the Dragon Ball. Now prepare to die! that tape with the gold. So this is a special tape. If you find the, it's the only, the only uh, Dragon Ball Z uh, release that's in like pure gold. Because it's special. And you know, Dragon Ball Z just became more and more special as the years went on, as the decades went on. So it is very fitting that the beginning of it is pure gold. I mean, this t the, 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 the tape is like an analogy for it. The show was pure gold. The beginning of it was the beginning of something gold, something amazing. It's like Goku's doing that Kamehameha against you. It's like you're getting hit with a Dragon Ball Z punch. A fun action, fantastic su su suspense, and music, and holy fucking shit. Kamehameha. Lord Slug. I love this movie. Uh, I hope you people in the comments love it too. If you don't, that's okay. Get ready for a renegade Nemec with powers you won't believe. Lord Slug is coming. A lot of people talk about how the movies aren't canon, but if you look at the movies, the uh, Dead Zone is canon. The first Dragon Ball Z movie because they made the Garlic Jr. saga in the show. But anyway, in this movie, uh, there's a moment where Goku becomes really strong, really super in it, but he's not a Super Saiyan yet. So the events of this movie take place before he became a Super Saiyan, before he went to Namek. That's what they're trying to do in it, and really, it's uh, it's interesting how they did that. Like King Kai mentions how oh he's he's turning into a Super Saiyan, but it's, this is like a him an early version of it. You could make an argument that this takes place in a timeline somewhere, maybe. You all remember the Gargoyles, right? Cartoon in the 90s. Doesn't he look like one of the Gargoyles? Like the older Gargoyle? Like the, that outfit. You know, and he is like a bat, like a Gargoyle. I always thought that when I was a kid. But anyway, in the 90s they had all these super groups. You got the Turtles. You got... Uh, Street Sharks, Biker Mice from Mars, Power Rangers, and, you know, it was always like five of them. The Gargoyles, the Mighty Ducks cartoon. No, that's not the show people don't talk about anymore. I love those toys. Anyway, I think this is a really great movie. I think it's the best Dragon Ball Z movie, in my opinion. And it is underrated. And the music on the tape, by the way, you see? Featuring music from Disturbed and the Deftones. Only the tape version of Lord Slug 
the VHS tape contains these American bands in it. Featuring music from Deftones, Disturbed, and a host of other hot new artists. As the soundtrack in the movie, which is really nostalgic. Anyone growing up in the early 2000s like me in the 90s. It's not on the DVD versions, they removed it. So the only way you can have that is if you buy the tape. All you HD people, no, no, no. You need this, you need the tape. Uh, yeah, this is, this is a really great movie. I love this movie. I remember they made a big action figure of Lord Slug. A big one, I don't, they, I don't think they made a, a, a mini one. A small one, I mean, a regular one, I mean. Makes sense, you know, put them together. <laughs> Oh, yeah.